What's happening, folks? Back with another reaction. Back with some more Heaven 17. I'd like to give a big shout out to all those who commented on the first Heaven 17 reaction, including Han Solo and a couple others who corrected my slight misunderstanding about the transition between the you know first period and the second period, as well as you know who wanted to leave whom. Uh, but ultimately, yeah, uh, this is Heaven 17 in uh, Craig Marsh. Martin Ware and Glenn Gregory, uh, so ultimately I have a better sense of who the singer is now, who apparently was originally going to be the Human League singer and then it didn't work out that way. Um, nevertheless, I'm excited to go through this album. As I said, it'll be interesting to hear this in contrast to and in tandem with the Dare album as you know, Human League began going in their own direction. So. Ultimately, yeah, I did talk about the title of the album, uh, Penthouse and Pavement, when I began reacting to this, when I did the reaction for the first track. Um, and yeah, ultimately, that was an interesting tune, because it had, I think, a pretty serious theme, but it was embedded within this, you know, quirky and a bit, um, you know, frenetic type of um, tune. So yeah, I'm not quite sure, again, whether a lot of their tunes will have more serious like social or political themes or whether that's a bit more anomalous in that regard. But as I said at the time, uh, Penthouse and Pavement makes me think about the contrast between, you know, affluence and, you know, blue collar type of existence. You know, you're down on the pavement, you're down on the ground floor, you know, you're working among the people in the crowds if you're in the penthouse you're by definition way up high in a sort of elite space that not a lot of people can afford or ever get to see. So it feels like there's a contrast there um, and a couple different lines, both like social and economic. But um, again, not knowing their sense of songwriting, except as it relates to Human League, which again, I get there's crossover here, but um, not quite sure what to expect is I guess what I'm saying. Let's find out. This is Heaven 17, Penthouse and Pavement. And it's the second track on the 1981 album of the same name.
incredible. I mean, that's crazy. Um, I knew we'd hear some differences relative to the earlier Human League. Like, it wouldn't just be more of the same, especially because it wouldn't be the same voice. Although, I have to say, Gregory's voice, it's in the same ballpark as Oki's voice, it feels like. Um, but honestly, that's insane. It's like if you took a funk tune, a soul tune, and an energetic electrified synth tune and smash them together and somehow it works perfectly like that was really cool and unexpected so now I feel we're even more in territory where I don't know what to expect which is interesting like like again I didn't expect this album to sound identical to the original iteration of Human League but um, I did not realize how different it might be so yeah that was really cool enjoyed that even more than the opening tune although again I did enjoy the opening tune a lot in part because of the like the contrast between the gravity of the subject matter and the like the the energy of the sonics um, but this one is like a whole different ball game so yeah let me know what you think of this one uh, shout out to Han Solo again for sharing all this stuff I will see you next time peace